Hey MechWire, welcome back to Apple Plays MechWire 5. We picked up this nice little gem of a mech uh, in the last episode when we played all of the bow and arrow, all four of them out. Let's take a look at this and see what we're going to do with it. Um, I turn it into a brawler more often than not. I've seen it turned into a LRM4 monster, I'm sorry, LRM10 by 4 monster. And that works pretty good too. Biggest problem I have with the initial setup is the ammo setup. It of course won't do. Don't need streaks. Gonna make it a brawler, so Let's see what we got for sixes. And basically I just do the best I can with whatever I got. I got a decent amount of sixes, but Considering I already got two of them in there, what if we just went with all four as a tier one? But I don't have a match. Arties, but I don't want to use. <coughs> excuse me. Don't want to use Arties because that's an extra ton, and to me it's not worth the extra damage that it does. I mean that's a tier three, fifteen point eight, fifteen point eight. I don't see the extra damage. <clears throat> so, hmm. I already got two, like I said. Let, let's go ahead and keep them paired up properly. It's also kind of important to keep them grouped nicely as well. I don't think I need them on the arms. Not them anyway. I think what I'll do on the arms is fours. And obviously, still need ammo. So... Uh, hope we got some more. Do not. So, only got one double. That means this thing's going to be full of ammo. It's here and there. But I got a case laying around somewhere. That's not enough. I need that just for the SRM6s. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's, uh, let's take that out. And put in two more tons. Minimum. Let's put them on this side and drop a case. I think I got, oh, I salvaged a case somewhere. I know I did. I've, nope. Hell, fart. Okay. That's a hot mech, too, at this point. You can help that by taking out those and putting in regular medium lasers. All four. The same. Pairing them up always works best. I don't have any heat sink or doubles. I got one. I'm not going to put it in this mech. Thought I had a case. That's disappointing. Yeah, no AMSs, no cases, no, no, no the good stuff yet. Gonna be a long journey, f getting better, isn't it? I'm a long way off from being cool enough in this mech to run it. Oof. That's actually close. I'm gonna let that go. I really don't like having doubles in the arms, but... It's a good way to lose an arm and lose a very, very important uh, 
something we got one left? Nope. Gonna hold it. I can make that better over time. And unfortunately, I do believe I should paint all of my mechs. The same. Heroes as well as everybody else. Anything good here? Well, good has, you know, different meaning for different people. I'll go check out this one. Well, a quick draw. I would take an ivy. I would not take a normal quick draw, I don't think. Yeah, not normal. Um, that one punches pretty hard. I see LRM 20, which, yeah. Don't need another stalker. I, I would take a good thunderbolt. Like a hero one. And there's a hero mech right there. I will go take a look at. Oops. That'll learn me. No, no, it won't. I'll do it again. Almost did. Give me something good. Uh, which one? I turned this one down earlier in the game. I'm almost willing to take it just for the AMSs at this point. It's got a double heat sink kit. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. No. I got plenty of good 75s. Now the question comes where's the next hero mech closest to me? And I think it's going to be Hazing of the Week. Let's see, Hazing of the Week is the, uh, oh, which mech is that? Oh, that's the ON1 YAJ. That's a good one. Bring her home, can see the Victor Basilic, the Rifleman, which I can do without, the DNA, Diana, and... Yeah, I'm more inclined for that one, really. The dragon's a nice fit at 60 tons in a hero mech. Do I still have my Phoenix Hawk? I do. I can do that. But the other two are down here. Hazing of the Week, etc. Where are we going? Not that far down. Give me that little yellow thing. Tell you what, do it the easy way. Bring her home is Basilic. Way to the side. Okay. You'd think I'd done all this kind of stuff by now. Actually, I kind of do, but gotta walk you through it as if I don't. Sindalore. Out of range by. Oh, come on, Matt. I am there. Not arranged by a long chunk. Victor Bass looks two weapons, two art, two guns, two large lasers, and uh, SRM. Basically, it's an Orion with an extra, mm, extra gun. Where am 
I for time? 27. One more year left. Let's spin that year right. Good. Fatima it is. Fatima has, generally speaking, good assault mix. Looking for a hero, like a, uh, I don't know, boar's head? Not here, but we'll see. Wow, Centurion lineup. That's unusual. all you got? I'm at level 15. You're offering me rare urban mix in an industrial hub surrounded by 400 ton missions. See? Not kidding. Hmm. This is why I play high reward quest. Unfortunately, I'm 11 minutes in already, 12, 13 by the time I drop. I'm not going to be able to get all four of them in more than likely. Yep, see something's coming. Nope, don't, no time. Difficulty 55, 230 ton, and it is a beachhead. Cash. Way too heavy. Way, way too heavy. Not shaming them for their weight. Ah, boy. Hmm. You know what? No. Somebody needs to get some affinity in this guy. And she needs the ballistics training. It's the potential to be the best ballistics out there. And I've got no heart for swapping out for her. Limits, or anybody with better in stuff. In order to take the area back from the Crimson Inclination, we need to clear a path for the Six Archive Legion. A lot can go wrong in a big operation like this, so keep your wits about you. Let's get to work. It's a 230 Our ton drop, how is that a big operation like the this? Until the relays controlling air and orbital weapons are destroyed. Destroy them. There are several artillery batteries in the area. Search for them and silence those guns. We have unidentified battle next on screen. Soon they are hostile and engaged. You've been spotted. Expect incoming bombardments. Destroy. All artillery. Open fire. Good work, Commander. That's one less target. Keep forgetting this one only has mediums for lasers. Used to running Hero Max XLs with uh, large laser, double large laser, and a pair of fours to make up the lead. a lot more on the LBX. And I gotta hope I have the ammo for it. Long mission. Let's keep that in mind. Scratch that target Needless to on say, the the, uh, <clears throat> no artillery mod makes a difference. They just become targets, not necessarily a uh, priority, even. Target acquired. Target down. 
Set behind. Really? Target is down. Acquired. That's it for the artillery. That will make the invasion much easier. Target destroyed. Some of those were made out of apparently. And obtain him. Except somehow it was got it. easy to forget that your uh, lasers, ballistics, everything attenuates the damage done over the distance. So it might say five, but not that's at optimum range, not at maximum range. Said, medium laser. Okay, need to move. Not a priority target. Moving things are. guys behind me will be once I get them drawn out. back here, but there's a secondary reason. Turn's not in. <coughs> Artillery pieces in the far corner. Target acquired. 
even though I don't have them turned on, it can't hurt me. It's a... Just a thing. Go clear them out of the way. It's too late next to not follow. My buddies just got dropped. The speechhead just became... Well, the same as it was, actually. There we go. Let's not get distracted by the view. Keep focused. That's off. Reporting a new pile of rubble. How's that for focused? Even though Hacksaw says he did the kill, he might have with his LRMs. You might think he has. Didn't want to kick a rock. New target, spider. What? Yeah. I can't do that. Yeah, no kidding. Hacksaw here. See ya. Tells me to break through the perimeter. I was left with a pair of medium lasers, and that's it. Radio chatter indicates more enemy units inbound. 16 shots, plenty of SRM. Therefore, SRM it is. Like this for months. Another 
well protected guy. Twelve more shots. Focus target updated. Down below the rim. Target hmm. destroyed. That should do it, Commander. We can expect our reinforcements to arrive shortly. This is Brigadier General Razorsky with the 6th Arkham Legion. Thank you for clearing the way, Commander. My forces are inbound. All forces, move in! Mercenary, as long as you're here, we could use the help clearing out the rest of the field. As long as you're here, he says. Target, enemy dropship coming in right on top of you. operations here today. Thank you again for your help, mercenary. We can handle the rest of the insurgents from here. I remember them when this used to be hard. And count our blessings. It's not often an operation of this scale goes off this smoothly. Oh look, I'm still a 15. Two picks. Yeah, rather that, I'll use those. That's something I was teaching my grandson as he was learning how to play this game. These are pick things to sell or pick things to use. There is no in between. Tell me where I'm wrong. Let's repair them up. Um, Manadorf. This is one of the many, many uh, high reward quest missions where it rapidly escalates from what was a level six to Not that one. 270 tons. Still within range of upper range of 6. That's probably 7, 8 actually. But you come stumbling along it, you're going to wind up coming back and forth on this or getting your butt spanked. Because the next mission is even more. Um... I've totally forgotten what this one was, is. <clears throat> Demolition. It really is important to realize what you're getting into before you jump into it. Let's, uh... Let's take a look at what we can do to get a fourth mech involved. I do need more mediums. In particular because, uh, yeah, I'm going to go over. It's all right. In particular because Gestural Injuries Part 2 short. starts off at the 245 ton level. If you want to take three max, you're gonna or four max, you're gonna have to ton down quite a bit or lose cash. I don't mind trading cash, taking three max that are not quite a good fit, Objection. best fit. Reactor online. 
Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. The Crimson Inclination seem to have taken refuge in this area. House Carita wants us to eliminate them before they have a chance to regroup and rebuild into something that can threaten civilian populations again. Well, if you've been following along, they mentioned that one of the HD missions was similar to something I just couldn't put my finger on. This is a demolition mission. Come out on a nice beachhead, curve around, do a right hand hook, come up and get hit by a crap load of um, tanks and detox. There's no crap load here, but. For so that one, I'm shooting it. Just to get it up. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Enemy destroyed. Target destroyed. Yeah, that's a warm up for it. I think it's turn and burn. Could be blackout. One of those two. That'd be wouldn't it? I'm getting critical. You guys aren't shooting hard enough. How's that for criticism? Peace. It's on the LDS. Uh, 19. Let me start walking through stuff. Ah, we got him. Give him a 
thumb on the right button so I can change for at least. Regiment. However, Franson doesn't appear to have been here either. Let's get you back to the ship and report your encounter to our ISF liaison. Target destroyed! Target acquired. Good we'll have fun with that. This is Axa. See ya! Axa here. So they weren't shooting for it anyway. So this is a weird one because actually in that mission, mission on this next mission, sorry, lost my train of thought already. In mission three, you actually take out the dragon with Franzen in it. But then in mission four, it shows up again, and you get rewarded it at the end of it. And I'm going to have to do a repair and fly along. Where does? Did I mention how it escalates? This is a 315 or 340, I forget what. Level 6, 300, anything, 315. <laughs> Not really. It's a 70 assassination. I'm taking cash. Because cash lets me buy anything. Salvage makes me only get what I, they give me. And I got uh, quite a bit of tonnage left over. So we're going to go back to this. Put him back in... I think yeah, I want to even out the tonnage a little bit. The victor stays. I got 10 more for the hunchback so I can put them in a uh, warhammer. Not a big deal. Although, you know what? How about a marauder? Yeah, I don't mind the extra. I'll take a 20% loss in cash. Let's go. Get a little bit of affinity spreading around. It's not a bad thing at all. A lot of affinity. Mm. Attention. Prepare for battle next departure. Hangar doors open. Stand clear. In case you're wondering, the affinity deal is the uh, pilot overhaul mod, which I use, lets me train the pilots, as well as get them used to being in to track down active movement on the surface of this planet. Or a mix of a Looks certain like they didn't think this one through very well. Not me. Anyhow, I've marked the location of what I believe is the staging area of the... Oh, hold on. Hey, hey, I'm getting on. a transmission from Franson. Patching it through now. To the unidentified oh, yeah, AC-10. What am I doing compound. with AC-10 in this? I am High Lord Franson. Yeah, and I pulled Turn out a LBX now. a long time ago. You have no right to be just to go this into this. Space. My followers will not allow you to disrupt our operations. You oh. have been warned. Just kill him. Seems they know we're coming. We'll proceed as plans, Commander. But be careful down there. As they say, nothing is as dangerous as a wounded beast backed into a corner. The little guy's still I running around. Franson. For someone looking to tear down the social order, he certainly thinks highly of himself. Though I suppose you'd have a big ego too if you had a custom dragon to call you on. Our intel from the governing body tells us he's acquired one through his army of followers. Hmm. I'm not seeing our targets at this location. 
These C10s are much different than LBXs in the frequency of firing and speed of the shell, which makes a difference on the ballistics. <coughs> Thought briefly about jumping into that uh, big turn. Decided not to. Let's go ahead and pull out the dragon. Taking it out with leg kills, they're taking it out with cockpit shots, it doesn't matter. You don't get it in nice condition no matter what. Great work, Commander. You should be good to return to the dropship. House Carita will be pleased to learn that Branson has been taken off the board. <coughs> Didn't look to see where the dropship was. They move it around. Apologize for that. Gosh. I don't know where that comes from. They take meds to give you a dry throat, but I keep it well lubricated. And I'm playing one handed so I can drink. And I still killed that. And during that bit of silence at the end of that, it occurred to me that I have not actually pulled out the uh, cobalt made it available and fixed what ailed it to get it right. So let's find out. Yeah, no weapons. No engine single heat sinks. And only one ton left? Wait, wait a minute. That's not right. Yeah, it is. No X, no engine, XL engine. This could be fun. No, I'd have to run that with no weapons. Oh, this could be ugly. I can't take that out without re removing all the engines, or all the stuff. Oh boy. I can't run that in the hunchback, which would be the only one. No, it doesn't have any jump jets, so... Nope. Hmm. I can't run this thing this slow either. Take account this and dropping its speed down makes it too much of a target. I really didn't think ahead on that one, did I? Not at all.
And even that was a waste. I could have done something. Of course I'm gonna buy that. Have you not been watching me play? Nope. Okay. Battle mix. First things first, that's gotta go. I've gotta drop six tons. Seven tons. Fifteen days. I guess I'm glad I got that one XL at least, huh? Now. Typical normal loadout. And do I really want it? Would be a large laser here. Payer over here and some SRMs. Which I kept a ton of ammo in. And at least four jump jets, although it comes with six. I'm going to skip the large laser. I think that would make it too hot without the, uh, <coughs> excuse me, engine double heat sinks. And then, there are four on the arms. A full ton of ammo, but just the one, because it's a short mission, but not in the head. And we'll put it there. One more ton. Doesn't have a heat sink yet. And it needs one badly because I'm an overheat city. What I'm looking to be able to do is kill tanks in one shot. And that means at least three lasers. So all I can really do is Dump in one of these. Sixteen days. Never run it like this. That's a definite all at once. under tonnage we'll find out when we get there I'm really tempted but I know it's going to be a light mech I got that priority transmission five months supposed to be here. Why didn't it pull up? Yeah, okay. I accepted the wrong thing, perhaps. Where are we? All the way around. Look at that. Christ, might as well go here first. To be a locust or something. Ah, uh, you're a catapult. The J. Twelve million. I'm gonna take it. It's got AMSs. It's got double heatsink kit, not an engine, double heatsink. I'm gonna take it. I need wax max in that weight class just in case I get banged up on Kestrel. You can't just run them quick enough. Come on, dang it. Travel. That's the problem when you just use the cursor and the mouse to do it instead of using the space bar. Can 
17, uh, nothing. Sixty fifty. It's the only mission in the entire game, as far as I'm aware, where the difficulty level is higher than the tonnage limit. That alone makes you want to play it, doesn't it? Heavy weather warning is in effect, Commander. Your visibility will be compromised out there. Here's the deal on this one. Jump down, and take the Phoenix Hawk, and then you, you hunt for drivers. But first of all, this is some light one. Oh, I'm 10 tons light. Why was I thinking 35? Holy crap. I've embarrassed myself. This thing much, much better. I mean, I'll take it. After all, I was the one being foolish on that. Duh. Okay, now who's a good pilot on this guy? That's the kicker. Hit the right button, Opal. I don't think I've made a mistake like that in a long time. Mastered? Yep. Time to earn our sea bills. Of course, I have to configure the map. Commander, Brigadier General Rozovsky here. Hi. I wish we were meeting under better circumstances. Volume, time is on the end. changes in minor leave. ways. The few remaining Crimson Inclination members are attempting to meet with Hausteiner operatives about the possible arms deal. Naturally, you're not seeing individual pine needles. But the brass you're not playing, are watching in 4K. Would only tip off the inclinations foreign handlers. This, we hope, is where you come in. We want you to run an interception roll for our small strike force, drawing the inclinations mech into an ambush at a nearby ravine. The buggy terrain should make mobility difficult for them, mm -hmm. trapping them, and allowing my forces to move in and put an end to this once and for all. I've already supplied your CEO with the location. I know we're asking a lot from you, but the rest assured, you will be handsomely compensated. Razorsky out. So where the bed? Doesn't matter if I'm slow There's here. a smart way to go about this, Commander. Stealth is key to success. I have readings for a number of detection installations around that you should disable before they alert the inclination to your presence. Rozerski was right about the terrain slowing <coughs> us down. Use jump jets to dislodge from the swamp. It should make navigating through it easier. You're approaching a comm station now, Commander. Take it down. Target destroyed. Target acquired. 
This comm stations have to be taken down or you will face VTOLs all over the place. These things are nice to kill to make sure you're not shot in the back as you run up along here. I dropped a couple films today in actual 4K and it looked absolutely horrendous. It's like the higher I tried to put up the film, the more distortion I actually got. It made no sense to me. So I just quit. The comm station is in the area, Commander. Keep an eye out for it and level it. shoot me in the back at least. Yeah, I did 30, I mean, all kind of rendering and every option I could find, several tutorials on YouTube, and can't figure out why. Why I'm playing in 4K, dropping it in 4K as a full up file, and when I play it on my computer, it's almost as good as an MP4. But, um, load it up to YouTube and it says it's a 4K, but, uh, it's not. It's just distorted all over the place. Ugly. So I'm back to... A comm station is nearby, Commander. It's supposed Once to be 1080, it, I think. Destroy it. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Station is history. Kill the mobiles. Again. This will shoot much later. Got both of them. Once you've killed the uh, detector thing. You have all the time in the world. Take the time and kill the things that are going to shoot you in the back. And run over to the rut, which is a road. This one. Follow it to the bridge, go across the ridge. Because I have an Eagle Active Probe, I'll be able to detect the other mechs that i got to find. All five of them. Relatively easily. Okay, Commander. We've detected energy signatures for five battle mechs within the city. Use your agility to find and target all five. Agility, Once you've targeted them, lead them to the ambush chicken point shit. and join That's in the fun. It'll be like shooting fish in a to be a chicken shit. Not about killing the spider or any other mech in here. Might be about taking out a leg though if you can. if you want it. So, for sure. Play for five kills this time. New target, Locus. Target 
That's four kills. Only the dragon is left. <clears throat> in mind the dragon has a mask so it can track your butt and catch up to you. I don't know what happens if you kill it. It's like, is it over? I think it should be. City, scan, 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 scan. That's all of them, Commander. Now draw them into the canyon. I don't think I want to go for number five. I think I was pretty brave doing four. Keep in mind it's got an AC-20 on an arm. <coughs> last time I played this, I did have to go back and kill the last one. It's just was hobbling along on one leg. Dragon does not have jump jets, so it can't jump through the swamp area. delightful. It's just standing there. It's moving. AC-20 first fire could take off my leg in one shot. Sorta. Of. Here he comes. Looks like he take off the AC first fire. Yeah, that's, that's a problem. So you do this. right there behind me, look at him. Stuck in the mud. Cockpit head. All over the place head. Those are a bunch of mad fours and uh, what the other ones? Target acquired. Oh, Q, sorry. Catapult, K2s. Should take this thing out in about 10 seconds. Mm. 
Instead, they fiddle at it. That ought to be the very last of the Crimson Inclination. And if they took the uh, center out, then I just lost the core of the XL. for the lighting contacts that the Crimson Inclination was attempting to meet. We owe you our thanks again, Mercenary. Well, I'm at an hour. We'll not forget it. Coming Very seldom do any episode this long. Thanks for hanging in, if you did. If you didn't, you missed a fun one. And plenty of money. Ah, uh, they killed the XL engine. And that's why I play the missions for him. 18 share. Hmm. Well, time well spent. According to this, it's still available. Still available. Good deal. Well worth it. Let's uh, wrap this up as quickly as I can by going to Beecham. I don't like leaving things hanging completely in disarray. So I gotta strip out the uh, Phoenix Hawk to get the XL Lucian back out. So you. Just the good stuff. 15 days. And you. Just to make sure. Got an AMS out of it as well. We'll start from there. 10 days. See what's available. Nothing in particular. Call it an episode. Hey, Mick, where are Thanks for hanging out and watching this one. This was a lot of fun for me. Um, I really enjoy these missions. Um, the uh, I'm gonna buy that. By the way, the. Uh, High reward quest for the heroes of the Inner Sphere. Those are some, some of the funnest missions in the game. And most rewarding. Because you get good mechs, you get hero mechs, which are 20% better, give or take, than most of the mechs walking around, all things considered. So, uh, that's why I go after them. So anyway, we'll see you next episode. Opus out.